Alright guys, Blitz here. I'm going to show you guys how to play PS4 games on your Android phone. So you guys can see I'm using my PS4 controller to like control everything. And I am on the PS4 so you guys can see. So yeah, it's actually really easy and let's get right to it. Alright, so I'm pretty sure you guys want to play PS4 games on your phone with the controller. So the only way to do that is you guys need to have Android 10 or higher on your phone so I'm actually gonna go to my settings and I'm actually gonna show you guys that I am on Android 10 so there it is Android 10 so make sure it's Android 10 or higher or else this isn't gonna work so make sure you guys update your phone and if you guys are wondering what type of phone this is this is a Pixel 2 XL so now we can actually try to pair the controller to our phone so I'm just gonna go to my Bluetooth and then this is where we can start pairing so to pair the controller all you have to do is just hold down the uh, share button and the PS button until you see the flashing lights up here so this is how it's going to look like so I'm just going to hold it down and then we will see lights pop up alright so there's the lights so now I'll show you guys what to do next alright so for me I'm just going to go to pair new device and then it should pop up alright so there it is wireless controller so I'm just going to press on it and then it should turn to a solid color so you yeah, can see right there so now I can actually control my phone with my controller so you can see everywhere I go it's going to actually move which is pretty cool alright so once we pair the controller we're going to need one app it's called PS4 Remote Play so just search it this is how it looks like and it is free so I'm just going to go to it and then you'll just see this pop up so I'm just going to press start and it's actually going to start finding my PS4, which is actually on right now. Alright, so it looks like it found it. So you guys can see it's actually moving where I'm going. And it's actually showing the exact same thing on my monitor, so that's pretty cool. So I'm actually going to show you guys like me playing like a little bit to show you guys a quick demo to see how it's going to look like. So I'm just going to test it out on Fortnite. Alright guys, so here's the setup. So there is sound coming from the phone, so... Let me actually turn this up. So I can see it is coming from the phone. Like no sound is coming from the monitor. So everything is working. You guys can see. Now it is a little bit like buggy. So I don't know if that's that needs to be updated. But you guys can see I am on the PS4. It's like working. So let me actually uh, join a quick game. And show you guys like some gameplay. And do not make fun of me that I'm playing Team Rumble. But let's just see how this goes. And this is why you need to use the PS4 controller because like if you guys like touch the screen like no one wants to use these analog sticks like how the heck do you even move with this like I don't get how people would play like this so like the PS4 controller is obviously better. Alright so I hope they freaking update this app because it's like super like when I put the volume a little bit high like the sound kind of lags and like the frame rate that I'm seeing is like 10 FPS so like I don't know, like, they need to fix this, but I'm still trying to get my first kill with this. kind of hard. Oh, there's a guy right here. Alright, I don't know if that was, like, a legit bot, but, yeah, there's my first kill. Like, there it is, guys, on the PS4, using my PS4 controller, and then playing on my phone. So, yeah, that's how you do it, guys. There's the demo. Subscribe, give a like.